Hey, new types! Welcome back to Let's Survive Gundam Reborn, the dramatic conclusion to yeah. Char's counterattack. Yeah. Char has appeared. <laughs> we are going to destroy him. <laughs> That's what it says, right on the screen. He's gonna make you remember the pay of Lala's death. <laughs> But yeah, that's okay, because I'm full frontal, because you just don't know. Oh, that's right. This is a full frontal char battle. This is, yeah, this is. <laughs> um, we're going to do something weird. Uh, not really weird. Like, in, when we finish Char's counterattack, we're going to switch this over to Will's save. Uh, oh, just giving you yes. the heads up. Yeah. D nothing. Ba basically, yeah. the only reason we were going to my save was uh, on my save. We have... Um, I have a live beat and I have a whole beat, the characters and stuff, and it just yeah. it makes it just a, it makes it just a little more uh, fun. Okay, so I just feel like an asshole because I just put Char in the corner and beat him to submission. <laughs> there, there. <laughs> Actually, in, in a lot of warrior games, I feel bad with that. It's like, oh, a character I really like. Oh my god, I just juggled. Yeah, yeah, I just beat him up. <laughs> it's like, oh, there's my favorite character. I know. I just I feel like a bully now. <laughs> I. Amro, no, I want an even fight. What are you doing? <laughs> I, I built this new Gundam. <laughs> I built it. This new Gundam isn't just for show. I get that. Drop me. <laughs> Jesus. No, you're like a graveyard bully. <laughs> <laughs> Pissing on corpses. <laughs> that is the... That... Would anyone ever do... Like, I couldn't imagine anyone ever doing that. Like, defiling graves. Oh, I... I don't know who even wants to bother doing that. Yeah. Yo, we just took this little flag from the grave. It's a little American flag. We it's so ma yeah, it's messed up. I don't know why, but with the point, yeah, I mean, we'll say that to, like, high schoolers and stuff. Like, Yo, man, look at this. <laughs> and college students that don't have anything better to do. Yo, but the frat told me to. <laughs> I have to be accepted. My dad doesn't love me. <laughs> oh, oh, man. <laughs> So wait, he just has like the like. This is why like Char's counter attack is so legendary because of these speeches. Like, <laughs> no, no, he's yeah, no. Char is the speech king without, without question. And stay home and do what? <laughs> <laughs> Captain, wait, wait, please get out of here. No, no, this is a matter for men. Oh yeah, that's right. Because this is still the '80s and uh, man reign supreme in space. Yeah, I see. <laughs> Was that Lala in your group? Because he was in the Galaga? Is that yeah. who you picked? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Char, insult to injury. Uh, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> yeah, that, that was bad. But we did it. <laughs> <laughs> Char's counterattack. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, Char's counterattack. New types, we are, uh, we are moving on. Uh, even though some people... We got it. <laughs> we don't... <laughs> even though some people don't want to move on from... Uh, Char's counterattack. Some people view Char's counterattack as the end of the the great battle of Char and Amro. Oh, but that's just, why you have the after colony stuff. You have, you have all that, and uh, yeah, I mean, you know, so technically, I mean, you know, Unicorn. Sometimes why there's the gripe with Unicorn is that it doesn't feel like its own story. It's basically the end of Char's counterattack. Unicorn. That's basically yeah. what, 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 what it's. Do you, what it's why? Do you feel like there's a fan, there's a fan base that's like stuck like in Char's counterattack mode? They're just like, yeah, no, I haven't watched anything after it. It's just like I can't. <laughs> like you had to like have Will slowly raise. <laughs> just raise it. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, no, because I, I I felt like okay, no, this is the ending, but Unicorn was fine though. Um, that was, you know... Well, Unicorn's, like, pretty much right. Unicorn was, uh, three... three it, Unicorn was only three... What was it? I think it was three years after Char's oh, okay. attack. So that's why everything is still fresh, and, and it gives people... I'm glad it kind of it puts an end, at least to the anime version of, of Gundam. Like, what, what goes on with... What were they thinking Char? with this text? Like, could they have, like... Could they have crunched that a little more? Well, then it's big again? Yeah. Yeah, no, I... <laughs> but, like... That's why we have to show the world this light with... Now, that's... Okay. Yeah, Amro, I want to agree with you, but some people are going to, like, see that light. But at the same light. time, you're just a fatty scum. <laughs> <laughs> Gato just shows up gives you a high five. <laughs> yeah, fuck this fatty. Oh, my God, I... I was just about to call you Amro. I was about to say Amro. That's why you gotta see Unicorn. <laughs> Great. <laughs> no, so that's not, so that's why you have to see, because the way Unicorn is, it's just like 
So, what are you saying? Zion was right the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> That's some amazing. Of, some of the stuff they pull it, 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 it was was good. The, the characters in um in Unicorn, I, I didn't uh, I didn't like as uh, as much. Well, I was talking to my um you know Sean, um, my friend Sean, mm-hmm. and he basically said you know like I thought this was interesting because you know we talk a lot about Zion on this channel like you know like basically their ideals. And he was like, oh, you know, like, so Char's like a villain, essentially. And I just said to him, well, I guess you could see him as one, but... He's not a villain. He's not a villain. <laughs> no, look how, like, religious that is. How dare you? He's not a villain. Well, because, like, most people come to Gundam and they'd probably assume, like, you know, Zeon were, like, villains because they have that Nazi, like, stereotype. Right. Right, yeah, no, of course, but and the thing is... And I, I mean, I was like that, like, oh, when yeah. I first, like, when you, when you got first... absorbed into the Gundam universe, like, I would just make fun of, like, the <laughs> Nazism yeah, of Zig, you know. hi, Zig, hi. Yeah. <laughs> that, no, and it, it is true, when you see the original Gundam is pretty much... Well, if you stick with it, I mean, it eventually gets better character developed for Char and everything. <laughs> No, you didn't. Oh, you didn't want to see Shinoska's name again. I'm sorry. Who's that voice actor? <laughs> what was that faggot name? <laughs> Kenichi Susika. <laughs> Pretty much. But no, I, I think that's a. I think that's actually. A really I don't want to sign po- in. Oh, I know. I hate that. Honestly. Okay. So we are moving on to Unicorn. Um. So what we're gonna do? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, I have to. Yeah. Um. Would you do New Game? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So this is what we're gonna do. Full front. This is gonna be a shorter episode. Um, we're just gonna load in Will's save file. Um, and, we could uh, just start off fresh with the unit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we're just gonna start off with the unicorn. Mm. Um, next episode. Yeah. And you know, we'll see you then for unicorn. Yeah. All right, guys. <laughs> see you then. Bring on a whole god up in this bitch. <laughs>